Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do an oldies but a goodie. These are products I used to use back when I first started doing makeup about 20 years ago. Yes, I know I'm aging myself. But anyway, it's a Laura Mercier Secret Camouflage. I love this product. Actually, this was introduced to me by one of my favorite makeup artists that turned out to be an amazing celebrity makeup artist. And I remember sitting at dinner with her and asking her what's her favorite kind of concealer. Well, this was it. I went out and bought it immediately and I've been in love with it and for some reason I stopped using it just because I wanted to try different fonts or concealers out there anyway this is a great concealer it is two different colors there's a lighter and there's a darker now some say that you could use it as a concealer but it is a little bit heavy but what I tend to do is put it in the back of my hand kind of warm it up a little bit and then go in with my finger and pat it in or it's great for like touch-ups for when you have a little acne scar or you know something that you just want to do a quick touch-up and you don't want to take all these foundations and, and stuff like that in your bag. This is a really great product to have. Um, now I'm going to go ahead and show you how I like to use it. Like I said, it is a little bit on the dry side, but that's what I kind of like about it because a lot of times there's, um, or I keep saying foundation, there's concealers out there that are a little bit too oily and they tend to crease a little bit too much so the reason why I love this is because it is a little drier so you have to put it in the back of your hand just to kind of warm it up a little bit and you can mix both of the colors until you could get the right shade now what I like to do is I like to put my foundation on first before I put my concealer on and what I do is I normally kind of skip around this area because sometimes I have to use a corrector or, or eye brightener on or underneath my concealer. So I do like to kind of layer my products a little bit. So that's why I kind of skip around my eye area when I have my foundation because I don't want to keep layering all these different things and then you start getting a little crepier and like when you're in your 40s or over that's the last thing you want to do so anyway this is why i like this so i'm going to put it in the back of my hand i'm going to go in and just kind of pat that in there and like i said you know you'll figure out how much you want to use because i really wouldn't use too much because a little bit goes a long way it does last a while i usually have this for a couple months and then i kind of toss it but you know what? It, it, it'll it last you forever. It's like underneath $34, depending on where you buy it. But it is a great product. So what I do is I just add a little bit to the dark areas like so and just kind of pat it in. And then I kind of drag it down with my finger. Now this, you could use a brush if you want, but normally I just like to use my finger. I like to use my fingers a lot. And then I just kind of drag it down so it just gives you a little illumination underneath. Okay, so I'm gonna do that right now. I would do one side. And you wanna be careful because you don't wanna look like a raccoon. So you can see how much it, you know, it brightened underneath my eye. And for me, I have oily skin. This doesn't get into my creases. It doesn't get crepe or anything like that. So that's why I like it. But anyway, I hope I brought you a new product in case you've never heard of this before. And try it out and please leave comments beneath. And I will see you soon on my next video. Bye.